Hello, my fellow lovers of beauty. I am back to share with you guys five quick and easy tips that I did to spruce up the outside of my home. Um, this picture that I'm sharing with you here is the outside of the back side of my home. And stepping away from it, I've always thought that it looked extremely boring. Granted, the paint job is the same custom paint job that the builders did, of course, when, they when the home was originally built. And just again, looking at it, I thought there has to be something quick, simple, easy, and inexpensive that I could do. And so I opted to start here at the borders of these windows. And again, looking at it, you would, you would not even know that the borders exist. Um, they really look non-existent. So adding a simple coat of paint around those windows at those borders will make a huge difference, guys. Huge difference. And it's inexpensive. I did the same thing here at the door and the door frame. I kept the door frame consistent with the painting at the windows frames but that door i gave that door a pop of color and it made a huge difference as well and even added to the decor of my home um, for the patio area you can go up top and you can paint there at those windows as well i did not have a means to get up there i'm a shorty so i haven't gotten away up there yet but if i get a chance i will definitely go up there and paint those as well um, right here at this negative space treat it the same as the inside of your home and add you some decor there It'll make a huge difference. Sharing with you those five, uh, three items that I mentioned uh, that I to update my home, the windows makes a huge difference there, right? Doesn't even look like the same house. When I backed away from it, I was like, yes, <laughs> it looks great. So I was extremely happy. I thought it turned out really beautiful. That door and door frame, um, again, I kept the border colors consistent. So the same as around the door, I, uh, the windows, I put it the same around the door, but the door, I gave it a pop of color. I painted it an orangish red and I thought it turned out absolutely beautiful. Um, number three, that negative space, I decided to add some decor there. And what I did was I went to Ross and I found these two route, route iron pieces and I thought they would be great for outside and it would spruce up my home. So again, I added them there the same as if I was decorating the inside of my home and it gave an inside home feel. So I loved that. If you have any wood pieces, stain it. Uh, it will make a huge difference. Even if it's your patio, uh, it will make a huge difference. This potting bench here, I have had for years. I stained it to just give it a pop and look at the difference that it made. Absolutely gorgeous. I love it, guys. I, I thought it, it turned out great and, and it was inexpensive to do. So that was a, a great pop of color to my patio decor as well. If you have an old rusted out grill, reconsider getting rid of it because there is some spray paint out now that you can use to update that grill and it will make a huge difference in how it looks. I purchased that spray paint and applied it to my grill and look at the end results. Absolutely gorgeous. I love it. Now this is a five gallon barreled charcoal grill. Normally goes for 100 to 200 bucks. I use a $3.68 can of paint to update that grill and I'm happy. It has served our family for years and I'm okay with keeping it as a part of our family. Okay guys, that's it. Those are my five suggestions, my little five tips. I hope it helps out. I hope you get some inspiration from it. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below. If you like the video, please thumbs up. And as always, Continued blessings to you all. Bye-bye, guys.